what's going on guys my name is chris and i'm in the mood to play some scary games so i really like scary games um pretty much played most of the big ones that have come out and i'm a big fan and it's getting to be that time of year october halloween where they're going to be coming out with some more stuff hopefully i know that uh the new five nights at freddy's game Sister Location is coming out pretty soon, in about a week or two. Um, Outlast 2 is one that's definitely on my list. And last thing I heard is it actually got delayed, so we won't be seeing that this year. Sad face. Um, I don't know what else is coming out, but I figured it's about time to get back in the spirit. I haven't played a horror game since, ooh, man, I don't know, uh, Soma was like the last big one that I played. So I decided to just kind of like jump into some uh, some indie horror games and get back in the zone, if you will. I need to get get prepared and get back into that mindset and get used to doing the scary thing. So um, this is Mind's Eyes. It's a free indie horror game. You can get it on Steam. Um, I believe it's probably also in Game Jolt, but I downloaded it on Steam. Um, it's developed by Stanislaw Truchowski. Uh, hopefully I did not butcher that name. Anyways, we don't really know much about it at all. I believe this is meant to be covered in a single playthrough, so that's what I'm gonna try and do. I'm gonna do my best. And beyond that, let's just do it. Okay. We went in the door. I'm guessing, from what I can tell, this is like a inside a house haunted house game mind's eye contains flashing lights and flashing lights affect any of your medical conditions please avoid the game if i was affected by flashing lights i would be dead by now after how many games i've played please increase the volume to a reasonable amount proper volume will allow you to experience the proper atmosphere um okay no safe features game has an estimated game time of 30 to 45 minutes Fair enough. Okay. Game is made to be played in a single sitting. As I expected. Here we go. Why did the thing stop spinning? Did it crash? Did it really crash? Oh. Wake up. oh, thank God. Wake up. Please. I'm trying. Why aren't you waking up? Because I'm tired. I was up all night. This is Michael here speaking for CCO News at 11 p.m. Just as yesterday, the weather has not lightened up much at all. In fact, it seems to have gone colder. Windows remain covered with thick frost and some neighborhoods down in the southwest are losing power. I'm sure all hope they are safe. So we're in a, a snowstorm or a rainstorm. Word was released that there was a murder taking place, but police are saying, uh, let me see here. So a woman was killed in her home two days ago when the weather storm began to disperse. Okay, that's not good. This voice is so deep. Alright, so what are we working with here? Yeah, a little sick jazz. Alright. Okay, so my house is very fragile. Things are breaking from the storm. I can move forward, I can move backwards, I can move left, I can move right. Can I interact? Can I jump? I cannot jump. I can make a silly... When I jump, I do one of these things. Okay, I can't seem to do anything with the radio. E to interact. Gotcha. Hello? What the fuck is this green thing? Oh, it's very dark. Hey there, little guy. <laughs> Jesus, that was loud. 
a bear, used by the young to fall into a deep slumber. Whether good or bad times, the teddy bear will always be by your side. Collecting all five bears will drastically affect your overall score in the end. Good to know. Why? Okay, there we go. I was looking for a light switch. Got a little uh, frosted glass. Nice touch. Or is that supposed to be a wet window? It could be a wet window. Can I crouch? I cannot crouch. I can run, though. Why do I have a safe in my living room? I'm guessing that's what that is. A vault with a lamp above? Uh... Oh, it's asking for, like, numbers and stuff. <laughs> Who would make it that easy? It's not on the back of the safe, right? That'd be kind of silly. So we're looking for numbers. Keeping our eyes peeled with numbers. Okay, what's this? I heard what happened to Tom. Don't you dare forget that it wasn't your fault. The car lost control. There was nothing you could have done about that. The more you blame yourself, the harder this will all be. Tom will wake up. I promise. Call me if you ever want to talk. Janetta T. I'm Tom, and I woke up. And someone put something way too heavy on that shelf. Thought I told you not to do that. So let's go into the darkness. Cause that's... Hello? I don't know where that was coming from. And that's dark as shit. I'm not going down there. I'm assuming this was... Nice. Oh, great. One of these games. We got us... Uh... Oh, Jesus, it's fucking dark. Hello? Okay. Matches went out. So we just lost completely all power. Where's the circuit breaker? I need to flip the circuit. I'm gonna light a mat. Oh god, was that always there? Is that Prince? Prince, is that you? Is this my bedroom? I didn't even think to go in this door. And of course the freak. Oh yeah, because everyone keeps a circuit breaker in their bathroom, right? I don't remember this ever being here. Well, I sure as hell don't, because I don't remember being in this house. Period. Can I turn you off? You're very annoying. Okay, we got some bolt cutters. A bolt cutter? Probably can cut through th thick chain. What is this? A hockey puck? Okay, well, <laughs> you want to pick it up? Nah, wouldn't want that. I hope I'm not uh, stuck with a finite amount of matches, because I'm sure as hell not going to... Wait a second. Was that there before? I don't think so. Are we dealing with a poltergeist? Or is this a... Just a crafty weird man who likes to stack chairs? I couldn't really tell where that door was coming from. Hello? Oh fuck! What the fuck was that shit? What? Was that supposed to happen? Okay. Thanks for stopping by, guy. Didn't really need to light a match there. Okay, so apparently there's a random monster in my house that's just gonna leap out and scare the balls out of me off of me whatever was that something that I could avoid or was that supposed to happen I'm, I'm sensing a trend here like basically we uh, we go to the front door and every time we do something different happens
hear clanking sounds, but where is that coming from? I want to go in this room, but I can't. <laughs> what was that? Hey, man. Something tells you you're gonna be right behind me and you're gonna fucking jump out and grab me again. Hello? <laughs> well, he's not here anymore. I'm still just trying to figure out where the damn numbers are. Did I turn that light off? Why would I do that voluntarily? You gonna jump out and scare me, big guy? Hmm? Yep. A bolt cutter. Can I turn the lamp on? No. I haven't seen any numbers. There weren't any numbers on that note. Are there numbers behind the door? No. Hello? Is anybody back there? I don't like making it dark on purpose. Numbers? Okay, alright, that's good. I gotcha! No, no, no. Okay. You and your shenanigans. Some books. I don't remember if the books were here either. I'm questioning everything. Am I insane? Was that a fucking truck backing up? Oh my god, that's loud. Turn off. Oh, right. So, of course, naturally, I have to kill the power. Oh, I can't. Can't even do that. Well, that's good. Tim Buck says I'm gonna run into a freaking monster in the dark. Wait for it to go out. I gotta turn on the power again. Oh, god damn it. What? You ass. You stupid ass. You took the darn handle. Sure, he's gonna be standing right in front of me any second now. Up oh, there he went. Ah, fuck you. I'm not going to check that out. You dingaling. Now I'm gonna go check it out. What'd you drop in here, huh? Opening doors and shit. Oh, that's different. Prince is awake. Oh, oh, oh. I love it. First time you got me pretty good. Now you're just being a little tricky trickster, aren't you? Come back. You fool. Oh, this is good. This is nice. Why is there a creepy, creepy, creepy basement staircase thing that doesn't look like it fits at all in your house? Oh, this is nice. Ten bucks says the lights are gonna go out when I get halfway through. Or not. Hey. Hey, man. Hi. Oh, we got one of these things, huh? 
An infinite tunnel? Oh, not so infinite. Where the fuck? Are we in the same world? I don't know what that's supposed to be. That's weird. What in God's name is going on? Pressurizing chamber. Well, boys. Okay, I thought we were stuck for a while. Press and hold shift to run. I figured that out a while ago. Is, coming. <laughs> is, is that my guy? Too? <laughs> what the fuck was that? Activate all three computers. All right, I think we lost him. Oh God, he's behind me. I don't see any computers. What am I activating? Up, oh, found one. Beep, 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 beep. Holy shit, we got a real fucking hacker here. Oh god! Juke him! Juke him! Can I can I light a match while I run? Oh god! Oh, we're so fucked. In here, you'll never catch me. Now the key is not to get lost while we're Shit. Yep, there we go, buddy. Is this where it was? Oh god damn it, I'm already fucking Wait! You're fucking There's more of them! Oh god! What the hell? What? I am completely lost and confused now. This is the K room. This is the K where's the K key? <laughs> Running like the devil! Am I in a fucking dead end? Oh, Jesus Christ! Come on. Run your ass off, son. <laughs> so ridiculous how he runs. <laughs> I may have just trapped myself. I definitely just trapped myself. Is this where I came from? Oh, fuck, it's where I came from. <gasps> I'm gonna get you. Oh, God damn it. I thought I could run past him. Okay. I know what to do. Oh, fuck. That's a wall. What is this one? P. This is a different one. Oh, god damn it. He's right here. Fuck. Okay. Okay. Does it start me in the same spot every time? No, it doesn't. So that's why. Don't just fucking, like... Walk around. I wonder if the computers are randomized. That would be not cool. Now this is the X X to hack. Oh wait a sec. It saved my progress. Okay, that's kind of cool. Hi. Well, that was an exhilarating little uh, chase. Sequence. What the hell just happened? You're asking me, buddy. I don't know. I'm just living in your world. So in all of in all of that, so it's still numbers, right? It's not like X P K or anything like that. Okay, so Prince is still awake and very creepy. So is this door open now? No, it's not. I still have nothing to use bolt cutters for. Like, I don't, where is that, a kitchen? Oh, these are the lights going out, right? No, it's not. Maybe, maybe, it is. yes. All right, the lights are going out. That was a really loud chair. Chair? Do I hear footsteps? Besides my own? I don't know. Can you just take the bolt cutters? I'd feel better if I could hold the bolt cutters. 
so I can smack this thing when it comes after me. I hear chains! Yes! A reason to use the bolt cutters that have been sitting there taunting me this whole game. A crowbar. What? What? Are did I, did I take the crowbar? Maybe the crowbar will let me pry off the, um, the wood panel. Land of hooks. This is the key to get into the office. Sweet. Oh, man. You know what would fix that? A crowbar. I had a crowbar. I don't know where it went, though. Because apparently, when I'm through with things, I just toss them to the wayside. Maybe a battering ram will appear. Conveniently. Maybe the guy's trying to help me. He's just providing me with all these uh, interesting tools. So that I can facilitate my escape or whatever it is that I'm doing. Hey, man. Wait. Oh, that was a light switch. Huh. What could. Okay. That was just the light breaking. What could I use to unjam the door? I don't have any immediate tools that I can access. a new hook. Slowly hooks are appearing everywhere. I need a... I need a tool, people. I need something to break a door open with. I'm not sure what I need to do to trigger the next sequence. Did it just open the door for me? Can't fucking see. No. It sounded like a door unlocked just now. Oh, Jesus. Is that a chainsaw? Are we about to have to run from a chainsaw guy? Monkey Man's back. I don't know where he is. I didn't see him. I heard him, though. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, buddy. Where you at? Hide behind the door? Can I sit? Can I have a seat? Wait a second. Oh, great. Am I trapped now? I don't know what that chainsaw uh, power tool sound is telling me to do. I don't have a garage that I can go into. If I did, I would totally go there. Oh, fuck! What the fuck? God damn it. Motherfucker. Thanks for that. Thanks. Wait, am I in the office now? Okay. We made it into the office. I don't know how the hell that happened. I'm out of matches now, too, by the way. Can you turn the freaking light on? Oh. Hi, Tom. It's your mother here. I just wanted to see how you were doing. The doctor said that your coma is not so bad. Oh, it's not so bad. And that you should be up soon. I hope they're right, and I hope you're reading this right now. Why would they take me home if I was still in a coma? I just wanted to let you know that we never lost hope. Love you, Mom and Dad. Thanks, Mom. Wait, while we're here, numbers. We have numbers. Okay, let's see what's new in the world. Um, anything new? 
anything new. I don't have matches. That's kind of new. So we basically just have to explore all the past rooms and get something to happen. I'm not sure what that... Okay, I guess that's the... Oh, fuck, okay. This is new. It's not an office anymore. Another infinite hallway. I keep stepping on a bulb or something. Now we can jump. What the hell? Okay. Seems we have a. Uh... You're finally beginning to awake, aren't you? Shit, I don't know. I thought I was awake. Up. Oh, well, we're dead. <clears throat> I'm good. This could take a minute. Okay. Easy does it. Up, oh, up. Oh, this board is so weird and crooked. Okay, okay. Oh, uh, you got it. Oh god, it's spazzing out. Shh, no, oh, no. You're finally beginning to awake, aren't you? Yeah. You're gonna wake up. You're gonna wake up so hard. Follow the light. It's finally in your grasp, isn't it? Your yes. consciousness, just right there. Oh man, I thought that was gonna whiff that one hard. Oh, I screwed that one up. Don't make me start all over, please. Okay. There we go. There we go. Got to time it right. Time it right. Excellent. Press E to obtain your consciousness. Okay. Tom. Are we? Tom. I'm here. Is that you? It is. Tom, did you wake up? You don't get to decide when you wake up. That's my job. And you still have quite some ways to go. You think this was bad? <laughs> you have no idea what's coming. Oh, great. Oh! Okay. So, we're set up for maybe a sequel. Um, well, that was, uh, that was, that was pretty cool, actually. Um, it got me pretty good a couple times. Um, the monster is hilarious <laughs> in some of those ways. I really enjoyed the chase sequence um, with the discombobulated crazy man. That was a lot of fun. But uh, yeah, it's a neat little game. Um, it didn't take very long, and I liked it. I could finish it in one sitting. That was cool. And yeah, I'm really excited about more upcoming horror games. I'd be definitely interested to play another game um, kind of following uh, total total time in the game. 27 minutes. Total death, 7. So, oh yeah, I didn't, I didn't collect shit for teddy bears. I didn't even see that any others. Where, where would they have been? I mean, I feel like I explored that house pretty damn well. Unless they were in um, the labyrinth where I had to hack all those computers. Because I'm a, an expert hacker when I'm not being in a coma. Um, I, man, that, now I'm kind of curious where they were placed. Um, also, the vault. I don't recall ever seeing anywhere with numbers that I could have opened the vault with. Obviously, I missed a lot of stuff. I guarantee you there's probably a teddy bear inside the vault. That was one of the secrets. I wonder if you were actually supposed to see numbers somewhere or if you were supposed to somehow infer a clue 
from somewhere else in the house to basically guess what the combination to the vault might have been. Anyways, that was Mind's Eye and um, Mind's Eyes, sorry. And yeah, fun little game. Um, you can pick it up on Steam for free and yeah, pretty enjoyable. I'll be looking forward to see what other kind of things they come out with from this uh, the guy that developed this. So we'll just have to keep our eyes peeled. Anyways, that was a good, good uh, little experience to get back in the horror mindset, get ready for Halloween, get ready for some, some other games we're going to be playing in the future. Anyways, guys, if you like that, subscribe or like or whatever or, or do nothing. Um, and until next time, I will see you later. <laughs>